Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be another weekly vlog and it's a bit of a different one because I basically didn't record like all of last week and it's already Monday. So I'm going to recap the weekend for you guys, pop up some pictures and videos that I took and then I do have a few haul items to share with you guys. So let's get started on that. So yeah, last week was really chill. Um, we did Taco Tuesday with some friends and I really just wanted to be in the moment and enjoy so I didn't record anything for that but we had margaritas and we had tacos and we played um, Mexican bingo and I don't remember the name of it but it was a lot of fun. Um, so that was Tuesday and the rest of the week we really didn't do much um, and then I was off on Friday to drive to Louisiana to go to a family wedding. That's the one that I told you guys I was in that I got my dress altered for and everything so um that's basically my entire weekend was the wedding so friday night we drove in and we had the rehearsal dinner and then saturday morning all the bridesmaids showed up at 7 a.m to start getting ready because there was a lot of us um i believe there was like 10 people to do hair and makeup so um 10 people to get hair and makeup done so it was a lot of us um and we basically just hung out from seven till about two or three o'clock when we started taking pictures and the wedding was at 6 30 and so it was so gorgeous. My cousin picked out this beautiful indoor slash outdoor venue. It was so nice. And then when the sun went down, there had string lights in the courtyard and a DJ, and it was just so much fun. And it was a lot of family. So I was really just living in the moment, enjoying myself, partying down with my family. Honestly, it's so much fun when you can party like with your, now that I'm older, <laughs> you can like party with your cousins and your uncles and aunts. And my dad, especially, he is like the life of the party at any party we go to. So he was having so much fun and I was too. And me, my brother and him were all just being super goofy and dancing and it was so much fun. And congratulations to my cousin for getting married. And I am so excited and wish you the best. And she is going on her honeymoon to Mexico. So it's gonna be so much fun. But yeah, that was Saturday and then Sunday morning, um, we actually went over to my aunt's house to have leftovers from the wedding. So they took home some food. So we showed up probably around like 11 o'clock. Like we were all very late risers. If you, you know, couldn't tell we had been drinking the night before. So we weren't feeling that great. So we came over on Sunday, ate some leftover like pasta and stuff. And it was so yummy. And then we caught up with everyone. And it was just like a really nice weekend. Um, so yeah, after we had breakfast with everyone, which was really lunch, then we left and came home and Ryan and I just chilled at the house yesterday. So that was my week in a nutshell. Lots of lots of fun and connecting with my family and just having a great time. So I will insert some clips and some photos and stuff that I have right here so you guys can see how fun the weekend was. So we arrived to the rehearsal dinner on Friday and did our rehearsal at the venue. It was so so beautiful took some pictures <laughs> there's my beautiful cousin and then we headed on over to the dinner portion which was an amazing seafood restaurant and we did actually go out the night uh, before the wedding <laughs> it was a lot of fun and then um, woke up bright and early the next morning and got ready to go to the venue and we did go to maison de tour i believe i mean i think it was the most gorgeous venue ever they had a little like apartment basically upstairs where we got ready in the morning and it was so much fun and my beautiful cousin was amazing and she looked so gorgeous. Here's all of our dresses lined up. Here was our first reveal with her and it was just such an amazing thing to be a part of. Here is the final look with hair and makeup all done. My dress on, my heels on. You can see the open back there. <laughs> Everybody said that me and my cousins looked exactly like this day <laughs> at least the ones with brown hair um, and it was hard to distinguish us but there we are here's me walking down the aisle and then here is the venue before the wedding and here is the party after so they actually transitioned the aisle into a dance floor here's me and my mama here's all of us just basically having a ball dancing and just really having a great time and then seeing them off with rose petals and oh my gosh i cannot believe how amazing that was so I hope you guys enjoyed that. And I do have a couple hauls to share with you guys that I picked up last week. So I know they had, Bath Body Works had some good sales last week and there's like a body care sale going on right now. 
but I've actually decided that I'm gonna do a no buy in April because I've been buying a lot of stuff. So I will not be participating in the body care sale, but I did participate in the hand soap sale and I believe soaps were on sale for like $3.95 and it was a dollar pocket back. So I ordered some online to pick up in store and so that's what I got. So I have six hand soaps here. The first one is Blueberry Bellini. Got this one for Ryan because he loves blueberry scents. This is Wild Blueberry, Bright Citrus, and Sparkling Prosecco. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. And also, if you can't tell, my voice is still a little bit hoarse from just screaming and yelling all day on Saturday. So anyways, I got a warm vanilla sugar. I'm excited to try this in the hand soap. Um, it's creamy vanilla and sparkling sugar crystals. It smells just like warm vanilla sugar, very simple. And I think this is, yeah, this is the gentle and clean formula. So. I'll see how I like this um, formula. I think it's gonna be really nice. And then I picked up two mahogany teak woods just to have on hand for Ryan um, for any time of year, really. It's a really good scent. So pick those two up. Picked up a mahogany coconut in this awesome faceted packaging. This is creamy coconut, mahogany woods, and lavender. And the last one is sunshine and lemons. I really got this one to be a sink scent. It's yuzu, grapefruit, and sun rays. I'm, I like to do a lemon scent for the kitchen just cause it's like nice and fresh. So that one smells really good. And then I did pick up a few pocket bags. I believe I got a raspberries and vanilla and that one is in my car right now. But I have a coconut sandalwood. I have an into the night, which I was excited to get this one. And then a strawberry pound cake. So those are all the little um, things that I picked up from Bath and Body Works during that sale. And then I have some things from Ulta. So they were doing the 21 days of beauty event last month and I picked up the, or I tried to pick up the L'Occitane um, shower oil and they processed my order, they charged me, they said that it shipped and they said, oh, sorry, it's out of stock. So, never got my shower oil and that was like the only reason why I purchased, I did this purchase at Ulta. So that was, that made me really mad, honestly. But whatever, because I restocked on some things that I needed. So I guess it's fine, but I'm still like kind of mad. I did get this way thick hair um, treatment mask because I'm out of my hair mask and I want to try stuff from way because I've heard that they have great products. So I really wanted to give it a shot. It smells amazing. Mm, smells so good. So that is one thing that I picked up. I think this was like 30 ish dollars. Um, and then I also picked up the fresh sugar polish, sugar polish, it's like a face mask. It's a exfoliating face mask. And I want to try and do that like maybe once a week. Um, and it is made with real strawberry seeds. So it smells so good. Yeah, so that smells really good. I've heard great things about the Fresh brand and I just really wanted to try it. And I've been searching for a facial scrub. So that is also what I picked up. I think that was 20 or $30. And then I was really happy um, they had these like gift bags of free products if you made like a purchase over $50. So I got this whole thing of hair care for free. So this is really my favorite part about Ulta is they always have these like free goodie bags to give away and I always find really good stuff in there. So the first thing I got is the Virtue Shampoo and Conditioner. This is the recovery line. Um, little mini ones, excited to have those. I'm also out of mini shampoo and conditioner so this is good to travel with. I got a Bumble and Bumble Repair Styling Cream. Um, I think this is like a um, like a leave-in conditioner. So excited to try that. I know Bubble Bubble has some good stuff. I got this DP Hue Gloss. It's a unpigmented deep conditioner and gloss shade diluter. I'm gonna have to read how to use this, but it enhances color, vibrancy, and shine. So that's cool. Um, I got this Andrew Fitzsimmons Structuring Ten in One Leave-In Conditioner. Um, it has like the safety thing still on it, but. That is that one. I got a Brio Gio Be Gentle, Be, Be Kind Superfood Hair Mask. So excited to try that one. Got a Kristen S Air Dry Cream. I am really excited to try Kristen S because I've never, I've always heard good things. It's a little cap, how cute. And I've never tried it. So I'm excited to try this. It smells amazing. I got a, I don't know how to say this, Weed Ad. I don't know, you'll have to let me know down below, but it's an advanced climate control anti-frizz heat and humidity gel. This is cool. So it's a curl gel. So that's good for when I start wearing my hair curly again, which I am kind of 
on and off. <laughs> and then I got a Pacifica Pineapple Swirl Curl Defining Cream. I remember I picked out this packaging because, or this like um, goodie bag because it had some curl products in there. And the last thing is this Punky Color Streak and Brush On Hair Color. Okay. And it's red. So I actually wanted to open this up and see how it looked, but I feel like this would be fun for like parties or um, music festivals. I don't know. I thought it was cute. So that's what it looks like. But on brunette hair, there's a picture of it. It's not really that bright, um, but here's what it looks like. On blonde hair, it's really bright, but I still think it's kind of cool. And it might be nice for like, um, for Halloween or something. So that was fun. But yeah, got a bunch of freebies, so that was good. But I'm still mad that they canceled my shower oil because I think it was like $15, it was half price. So it was a really good deal. And I'm really sad that they, discon not discontinued, that they canceled my order, but oh well. So that's my little haul that I have for you guys, just some things, but I definitely am planning on doing a no buy in April, which just means like I'm not gonna buy anything that I don't need. So I don't need any more hand soaps. Obviously I just bought all those. I don't need any body care. I definitely don't need any candles. Um, if anything, I might need some like hair things or something. If I run out of anything, then I can buy it. Like if I run out of deodorant, I can definitely buy that. If I run out of shave cream, I can buy that. So things like that, I can definitely repurchase something that I've completely depleted my collection of, um, but I will not be purchasing things. And that's gonna include clothing and shoes. Um, I am like working towards buying my first luxury bag though. I'm working towards buying my first Louis Vuitton bag. So if that happens this month, then I'm okay with it. But overall, I just wanna not buy unnecessary things this month, um, mostly because Ryan and I are planning a few trips coming up um, and I just wanna save for those trips so I can kind of feel, I can feel better about that and also just focus on the products that I have and trying to finish those up. So anyways, that is everything for this week's vlog more of like a talk through video but i hope you guys still enjoyed it i hope you enjoyed seeing the footage from the wedding and i hope you guys enjoyed just catching up with me so anyways that is everything for this week's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed if you did like comment and subscribe down below and i will see you all in my next video bye